At the very least, you pretty much know how to pee. Although, no sim in this house knows how to pee without catching fire. So, maybe she needs potty train too. <laughs> ah! What? No, 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 no! Ah! I just have <laughs> Why? I didn't mean it when I said everybody died. Why is this happening? I don't mean to alarm you, but it's legacy challenge time. Nightmare. Legacy challenge time. So it's episode 32. We've been playing with these sims for quite some time now. We have three kids. One of them is a toddler. <laughs> and we are slowly but surely trying to survive, basically. is all That's all the goal is, is to survive at this point. Also, I'm gonna be honest, I have like no memory of it being Harvest Fest, but apparently last episode was Harvest Fest. I don't know. That's news to me. <laughs> Somehow I, I forgot that. Oh god. Okay, you know what? Scavenge for some parts. I was just thinking about how we're on the third generation and like we really don't have a lot of money, all things considered. <laughs> like you'd think we'd be further along by now. We're not. No, no, we're not farther along. I mean, at the end of the day, our house is worth what? Like 73k? That's not too bad. But you know, <laughs> this is the third sim. We've had three chances to have a lucrative career and short lifespan's just tough. You know, you can't do it. Why are you awake? Oh, because you were napping on the couch and not in bed? Oops. Okay, that's my bad. I need to pay more attention to my sims. Anyway, my plan today, I'd like to find the kids some friends. You know, we don't really do that. <laughs> My kids don't really have- why did you wake up? Go back to sleep. My kids don't really have any friends. I'm really, really bad about that. I kind of just don't bother until they're teens, but you know what? Making a group of friends, like maybe like a pretend group of scouts, I do that a lot. It'd be nice if they knew some other kids in the neighborhood. You know? Oh, there's only two other kids in the neighborhood. Okay. <laughs> we had two options. We got Braxton and Gerald. Okay. We are now friends with Braxton and Gerald because, well, that's all we got to work with. I'll, I'll download some more Sims soon. <laughs> Remind me to do that. Just for the record, if you post Sims on the gallery to the hashtag LookLilSimsy, that's where I go to like pull Sims to place in my neighborhoods. So if you ever want to make a family, I mean, we ended up marrying a Sim that one of you made, well, actually my friend made Mavis, but you know, we married a Sim one of my friends made, our sister married a Sim that one of you made, he's dead now, but you know, Lucas, you made Lucas, so um, may he rest in peace. Yeah. Up at 5.30 a.m. and showering. These kids, <laughs> although to be fair, I used to do that in high school, so god, my high school School started at like 7 o'clock in the morning, so I used to have to leave the house at like 6 a.m. It was very unpleasant. I can't say I recommend that. Not that you have a choice, <laughs> but I look back on those times sometimes and I'm like, God, how did I live like that? I used to get to school and it, the sun wouldn't rise until after we were in class. That's horrible. <laughs> I'm trying to prepare myself in case of disaster today. Like, let's talk about this, right? What could go wrong? Oh, my piranhas could die. That could go wrong. Maybe you could like, oh yeah, feed the piranhas quick. My piranhas could die. My dad could die. Emery an elder now. Someone could get eaten by piranhas. I mean, these are all very real possibilities. We need to be on the lookout. <laughs> oh, stop. I need to make- wait, sorry. Yeah. Why are you in the bath? Who takes baths in- mm, I hate how Sims autonomously use the bathtub. It's such a waste of time. Why are you mopping? Oh, the baths just take so much longer than anything else. Don't cook something. Don't cook something. You're wasting my time. You have to go to work. Why do they autonomously cook if there's food in the fridge? I, I never understood that. It's like, oh, we have stacks and stacks of leftovers. I'm gonna spend two hours making like lasagna at 6 a.m for breakfast and then be late for work and not even have time to eat it. That's a good plan. Oh, and also my Sam's vegetarian and he's gonna eat like salmon autonomously. I think they actually fixed that though. I'm pretty sure in the last update they made it so the Sims stop autonomously grabbing things they can't eat. My cat just ran down the stairs. <laughs> I just heard her just zoom down the stairs. Okay, he's gonna get promoted today. Like 100% without a doubt gonna get promoted today, which is good because I want money. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the other thing I should have him do is come take care of the plants. Do they need like what? Oh, this can be evolved. Do they need watered or anything? Yeah. He wants to take care of his plants so bad. This is his life goal. This is his dream. And I, I just didn't do it. <laughs> is anybody else really bad about that? Like with some Sims, I'll really prioritize, you know, doing their aspirations. Oh, I'm not going to work with you. I'm gonna have him work from home actually. We just got promoted. We got a bonus of 1500 simoleons. Now we make 220 per hour. He, he makes an additional 120 simoleons per hour. That is a massive upgrade. Are you kidding? Okay. Well, yeah, I figured we could have him work from home so we can actually take care of the toddler a little bit. Cause it, I'm sick of the toddler like, 
like not going to daycare when there's a maid here because the game like only this is my niece I'm busy anyway the game only sends your kids to daycare if there's not an adult in the house but for some reason it's counting the maid as being an adult in the house who's like supervising the toddler even though the maid is not watching the toddler <laughs> <laughs> Why did you bring him downstairs? Go back upstairs. Like, obviously the maid is busy and is not being paid. To, you're not a nanny. You can't just leave your kid with them. A leaf cutter? Oh, we've been offered a job as a gardener. That is his life goal, to be a gardener. We can't change careers again. We changed careers too many times already. I'm making- No. 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 You make $200 an hour. It would be really stupid to, to take this offer. <laughs> I don't care how happy it makes you. You make $200 an hour. You will suck it up and you will make that money. You'll be fine. <laughs> we are not passing up $200 an hour. Okay. Why is he upset now? God, he's always in a bad mood. Does he get fun from painting? No, that's fine. How do I get impressions for work? Impressions are key to building out a style board. Acquire this mood lit by quick sketching, viewing art, photographing, or talking about fashion with other sims. Okay. Well, my fun is low. <laughs> Maybe I'll like watch a movie for a second after he finishes his painting. <laughs> He's not doing a very good job. This is not his um, not his finest work. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Cam has a C in school. Okay, nice work, everybody. Very impressive. You're doing great, kids. You're doing great. Why do they both have trash in their in- Ah! Okay. Now, when I tried to click on the trash can earlier, it said that I couldn't empty the trash because there's no outdoor trash can. Is that even true? Oh. Do I, like, actually not have one? Wait. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say it was alive, but maybe it's not alive. Maybe I actually don't have a trash can. Can I do it now? Oh. Oops. Okay. <laughs> That's my bad. Well, I'm um, let me clear out the trash from their inventories. <laughs> Now I feel bad. How did I manage that? Okay, his painting is worth 276. Okay, well, it's really bad. So that's impressive, all things considered. I'm assessing an impression from it. I don't know what that means. Okay, it didn't work. Quick sketch impression. I think that's all I had to do before, right? Oh, well. Boring. Well, that was easy. And I made 1,750 simoleons from that. Working from home is ridiculous. What? Regional manager? I'm not going to work at Dunder Mifflin. Oh my god. I would simply not make enough money there. <laughs> I just got 2,000 simoleons for spending an hour quick sketching. I'm not changing jobs. Again, I don't care how much of a lifelong goal it is. It's not worth it. Why are you upset? Oh, I forgot to feed my child. That would be why. Okay, here, look. Nope, you got one. Grab some grilled plantains, Sam. Off you go. Oh, I didn't take care of my other kids' needs either. Here, look, 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 look. Grab one of these. Grab one of these. You too. I made dinner. See? Well, I made dinner like weeks ago. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I just snatched this. Who made that? Amber made that. <laughs> Amber was my first sim. We are on the third generation. This guy's dead grandma made this like years ago. I know I've got a lot of food in there that Amber made, I think. From Belle, Belle, Amber, Belle, Belle. Oh, okay. Well, most of it Belle made, but I'm sure some things Amber made. That's wild. <laughs> That's kind of bad. Why do I still have it on me this whole time? Okay, let's go take a shower. It's a Friday, so we don't have to work this weekend. We can like have some family events. Chelsea wants to come over? Yeah, come over. Oh, Chelsea's husband died. Oh, we really should made should have made more of an effort to like interact with her. Yeah. Oh god, Chelsea, yeah, I'm sorry. Sorry. Here, forget the forget the writing. Oh, she's playing violin. Okay. No, no, can you like talk to her? Again, your sister's husband is dead. <laughs> we really need to we really could could do well to make more of an effort to like befriend her. Oh, in the meantime, also, can I like potty train my toddler? Possibly a bunch of times. I don't really do a very good job taking care of my toddlers in this game. I'm just saying. I'm I'm pretty guilty of that one. Why is it upset now? Oh, because it needs to pee and is tired. Go, quick. Here we go. See? Oh, you're doing great, little buddy. Acquired the potty skill. See? Do you have purple eyes like your mom? Oh, they're like red. Oh. No. You have red eyes. Okay. Right. <laughs> That I feel like can't be good. <laughs> hmm. I just clicked complain about sunny weather. That's so annoying. Like that's actually so annoying. Share people person tips. There's so many random things we can do these days in this game. I'm telling you these lifestyles, I only have one. I know he's he's got the workaholic one in progress. I refuse to accept that. But like this people person one, he's not actually a people person. We don't actually have a lot of friends. We just have a big family. Like he doesn't have any friends. Oh, well, no way he does. He does have a lot of high relationships, but that's just because we were taking photos of them and you get really high relationship fast for taking photos. <laughs> Doesn't mean I'm a social person or that I'm good at talking to people in any way, shape, or form. In fact, it's quite the opposite. Become best friends? Yeah, become best friends with Chelsea. Oh, I'm so glad that he's close to his sister. He 
deeply connected. That makes me really happy. You know what? That makes me really, really happy. Okay, I'm gonna send her home though. I'm just glad to finally have like some family around. Cause for most of this series, like everybody's just been dead. So, okay, this kid's gonna be miserable. It's gonna wake up in the night and wanna eat again. That's fine, just go to sleep. Oh, your brothers are playing with your toy. You're gonna keep the toddler awake. I know you don't have any toys in your own room, but. <laughs> oh no, oh, it's already hungry. Okay, that happened really fast. Okay, let me, here, eggs. Take some, go, go. You got this. Hey, see? Taking care of toddlers is so annoying in this game. I know that I, I do the bare minimum. Oh, speaking of which, breed frogs? Great, sorry, <laughs> just wanted some more money. Anyway, I do the bare minimum in this game, <laughs> but it's, it's just the toddlers are, there's always something. There's always something with them. And the crying is, it's simply unbearable. All right, let's go to bed. Why did you pick the kid up? Don't put it to bed. Did it even get to finish eating? <sighs> I'm sorry, okay. Save game, drink some water. Deep breaths, we have some peace and quiet. <laughs> it's finally nighttime. Oh, thank God, okay. What if we got a cow plant? What are your thoughts on that? Because I know I have one death trap in the front yard. I would really like to have another one. And I mean that, like what if we had a little family outing? to the park to try and fish up some cow plant berries again because I I want a cow plant in my front yard. I think that would be really nice. And it's neighborhood brawl day. Oh, okay. Well, we can go to the park. We can beat up some people. And then and then we can, you know, um get a get a deadly beast to keep in my front yard. It'll be great. It'll be a wonderful family event. Lovely. <laughs> I'm going to have a muhu with Mavis. My fun is low. I can't be bothered with this. You know, Hurry up. Oh, do we have risky woohoo on? I always forget if I've got it on or not. I don't want baby. I don't want baby. I don't want baby. I don't want baby. Wait, MC woohoo. 1%. All right, we're gonna be fine. Although I have had a Sim get pregnant from 1% risky woohoo. Like not a, no. What happened? Ah, my grandpa did die. I told Emery's dead. We just, I said earlier, I was like, let's see what bad could go wrong today. Emery could die. I feel like I called it. I jinxed it by accident. I didn't mean to. Oh man. <laughs> That sucks. I know he was old, but like, I just wish we had more time. We never have enough time. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna work from home again today, I think. Oh, are you actually making breakfast or are you just making it for yourself? It's funny because her kids were both sitting there at the table, like ready for mom to serve up some meals. And it looks like she only made grilled cheese for herself. So that's nice. That's really nice of you. <laughs> Your poor kid's just sitting there waiting like, mom, aren't you gonna feed me breakfast? No, apparently not. Okay, here, do you want some more eggs? Oh, we can leave the toddler here when we go to the park. That'd be nice. Okay, let me just make sure everybody's ready to go. I mean, I know they're all like pretty sad because Emery's dead, but you know, what are you gonna do? And I'm making Noah write a tiny bit because he needs to get his skill up for work. Check in at a park? Wait, <laughs> ah, no, not the fire. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, anyway, I was laughing because we have a work assignment to check in at a park. Well, that was the plan anyway, so that works out. All right, this is not good. This is not good at all. Okay, cool. Anyway, I don't know why I'm acting surprised. Can you please extinguish the fire? All right, well, it's fine. We had too much money anyway. You know, I was really hoping that we would um, have to spend some money. Oh, play The Sims for 24 hours. Okay. We played the save for a bit. That's fun. Anyway, <laughs> as soon as Mavis is done showering, we can go check in at the park and get paid like 1,700 simoleons to do it. What? Why didn't it get rid of you? Hello? Wait, you're not pregnant, are you? No, we're fine. Okay. Anyway, let's go to the park. I love that. That worked out really well for me. We're already planning it and then the game's like, hey, do you want to go check in if like people are still wearing active wear? I like to think that Noah doesn't care about fashion at all and he's literally just in this career for the money, which is a bit weird because, you know, Noah has pursued many different passions in his life and to settle on one that we're doing just for money is a bit weird, but you know, it's kind of fun. <laughs> now, how do I check in at the park? Do I have to like, it just says travel to a gym or park to see the athletic attire. Do I have to like look at someone else in athletic wear? Anybody jogging around? What if I forcibly change her using a mod into athletic or we could go fight her. It is neighborhood brawl day. Beat her up. Beat her up. This is bad. I shouldn't. Oh, well, it's not bad. We're not gonna get into an argument. Oh, the kid's just watching. Oh, that's the kid we want to be friends with. It's Braxton. Oh, we could fight Braxton. Oh, they're hugging. See, that went really well. Can I do it again? Ask what Danielle's problem is. Oh my god. I'm pretty sure I won that one. Oh yeah, Danielle's mad at me, but that's just because I beat her up, so. Oh, this person's got athletic wear on. Oh, <laughs> oh my kids are fighting too. Come on, cheerful introduction. Come on. Mavis caught a salmon, all right. Okay, I introduced myself. Compliment style? I don't know how I'm supposed to check in at the park. I don't know what that means. Ask to join household. What? <laughs> Why would I want her to live with me? <laughs> no. Oh, there you go. What? I have a 
pristine reputation? I can host charity benefit parties, gather other do-gooders together for a fun time while contributing towards excellent causes. Do you know what this reminds me? If you didn't know, <laughs> <laughs> All of May, every day in May, I'm streaming on Twitch to fundraise for St. Jude. Let's talk about that. Last year in May, we raised $118,000, and then later in the year, another $80,000. We raised $200,000 total for St. Jude last year, and this year we're doing it again, and I think we can smash that goal, I'm just saying. I can link a donation page down below if you'd like to donate. Please don't feel like you have to, but if you would like to donate to St. Jude, I've got a lot of exciting plans this month. <laughs> I have a lot of things laid out, I have a lot of surprises, so I have my Twitch channel and our donation page down below. But also, St. Jude and Design by Humans, a merch company, teamed up this year with some creators to make like official Lil Simsy merch, but the proceeds go directly to St. Jude. So we have a t-shirt. It says Cool Cats Against Cancer. It looks like this. It says Cool Cats Against Cancer on it, which is kind of a meme from a long time ago. Back a couple years ago when I first started doing fundraisers for the American Cancer Society, my dad would come in to chat and be like, you're a bunch of cool cats in reference to the people in my stream that were donating. And then people all started saying Cool Cats Against cancer and it became like this whole thing. Anyway, anyway, this cause means a lot to me. I don't know if you knew this, but my dad has cancer. He got diagnosed when I was 14. And so I do a lot of fundraising on my Twitch channel for various things, but we are going to go hard for St. Jude this year. And if you'd like to buy one of these t-shirts, I'll have that linked for you down below too. Anyway, I'm sorry. Anyway, Noah just has a pristine reputation. He can have charity par parties. That I just thought I should tell you about our charity party. <laughs> in case you were interested. I'll probably mention it a lot this month, so just keep that in mind. <laughs> I'll probably bug you about it a bunch, but... Oh, I forgot I put this here for his grandma before she died. Oh, someone started baking a potato. Maybe I'll go... I can't work on it because... Oh, my cow plant berry! Oh, perfect. That's what I wanted. Okay, well, it's all worked out now. Cam got us a cow plant berry. And Cam's gonna be the heir. You, sir, that's major brownie points for you. <laughs> you found me my special present. I can use it to destroy my enemies soon. I like how they're both just sad and fishing. Like, this is miserable. <laughs> they're having an awful day. This is not the big family fun day out that I was intending to have. He hasn't caught anything either. He literally just caught a cow plant berry and that's it. At least Mavis caught some fish. And she had the breakthrough she needed for work. Wait, is that something? Come on, Cam, buddy, you can do it. Oh, that looks really gross. I'm not gonna lie. What is it? A violin? That's worth 400 simoleons! Cam, we're rich because of you! Okay! Yeah, you did your part for the day. <laughs> you have served your purpose. Maybe we can go play with the other kids. Wait! There's more kids at the park! Look, look, wait! Look at all the kids that are here! Preston and- No, come on! We gotta- we- <laughs> We actually have options! We have friends! I thought there were only two kids in the whole world, but <laughs> there's at least a couple more. Oh, Cam caught his first fish, too! Oh, you're doing great! I'll sell that. What's the- Oh, the romance festival is in town. Okay. Well, I'm probably not gonna bother with that because <laughs> I'm already married and it's not really a, um, a priority. How much are you getting? Yeah, Mavis has caught us a bunch of fish. The other thing is she wanted to dig up some stuff. Oh, there's free food over here. A bunch of free food over here. Hey, kids, <laughs> do you all want to come eat? We got free dinner. Kim over here made it. Kim? F hmm. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, oh, Kim, your makeup's rough. Dan, we probably should bleep that one out. I don't, I don't think I can say that on YouTube. I don't think it's allowed. Well, thanks for the dinner, Miss Kim f Really appreciate that. Well, this has been a fun day. We all got to eat for free. We made fish money, you know? Oh, she's cloud gazing, see? Look, I made like 325 smillions for my fish. We have a bunch of money. We probably could, oh, is he making a sand castle? Aw, is Kim f still here by any chance? Oh yeah, there she is. Nice lady. Really nice lady. <laughs> she did make us dinner. Can I take all this stuff home? I don't think I can. I think she made all of it. She was just on a roll. Okay, well, we probably could go home now. <laughs> I didn't have a successful neighborhood brawl. Should I have beaten somebody else up? Is there even anyone else here? It's already eight o'clock. Oh, my sister's here. I don't want to beat up my sister. Can I beat up this person? Offer to make up? No. You can't just offer makeovers to people. You can't just walk up to someone on the street and be like, you know what? You're really ugly. Oh, it's Angelique. Oh, I don't think any of my kids have technically met Angelique yet. This is their cousin. Oh yeah, we really should all come talk to her. Is anyone even coming over here? Yeah, they're just really slow. Okay, TikTok. I'm waiting. I was all excited about having a cousin so we can finally be friends with somebody and then, well, <laughs> we, we never even interacted with her. 
So that's cool. Should we build a sand sculpture together, me and Angelique? It's like 10 o'clock. My kids still have not made it over here yet. Oh, here we go. Here we go. One of them made it. Nice work, Graham. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, no, that wasn't my kid. That was somebody else. <laughs> I just saw a child. I thought it was my- Oh, I should go home before I pee my pants. That would be really bad. No, we need- Yeah, we need to go. <laughs> no, no, forget it. Just go home. We met her at least. Ooh, run inside and pee. Run inside and pee. Please, toilet, don't- Don't blow up, please. Okay, that was a close one. All right, I'm making all my kids take showers and stuff because we have been, like- fishing all day. The other thing, I know that we have this cow plant berry. I would very much- are you just hanging out on your phone on the toilet? Oh, don't worry. He's just browsing TikTok. Can't say I blame him. Okay, I wanted him to come plant this in the front yard though. This is really important to me. You can go to sleep afterward. I just- I want my cow plant very, very, very badly. Water with your tears, thank you. That's wonderful. That's- that's just wonderful. You know, my tears and- and the stars, it makes for quite the picture. Yeah, that's tough. <laughs> the red plum buff. He's in a really, really bad mood. He's had a rough day. Not even really though. I mean, you know, you got to work on your dreams. All we had to do for work was go to the park. I mean, we really are sitting here like fully scamming this fashion industry business because I have no reason to be making as much money as I am. I don't do anything. So at the end of the day, we're having a great time. It's just that, you know, everyone we know and love is dead. But otherwise, like, it's fine. Okay, bedtime. Off we go. Thank you. Have a great night. It's almost Cam's birthday. Ah! Already? Oh, short lifespan's so scary. <laughs> it's almost Sam's birthday too? Oh no! Okay, well, maybe we can have a birthday party next episode. Rebecca Bowen has passed away. How do I know that person? Oh, she was nice. Rebecca Bowen- Oh! Rebecca would have been Chelsea's sister-in-law, right? Let's see that here. Yeah, Rebecca Bowen was Lucas's sister. So Rebecca was Angelique's aunt. She's not blood related to us or our kids, but she was like part of the family. And I'm pretty sure I talked to her at the park yesterday. Like <laughs> we were, I'm pretty sure she's the one that we went to like check out the fashion with. That old lady who was in the, the athletic wear. Yeah, that's tough. We just saw her. Wow. Well, may she rest in peace. <laughs> I'm telling you, everybody's dead. Everybody. No, the kid is the first one awake. Can you potty train yourself yet? Oh no. Maybe I'll like ask mom to come help. I know this is like the first thing you're doing this morning. You haven't even peed yourself yet, but like that's motherhood, you know? It's better you pee your pants than he pee his pants. He needs to learn how to pee sometime. So at the very least, you pretty much know how to pee. Although no Sim in this house knows how to pee without catching fire. So maybe she needs potty train too. <laughs> ah! What? No, 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 no! I just am done. Why? I didn't mean it when I said everybody died. Why is this happening? Oh my god. I'm telling you, you can't. There is never an episode where someone doesn't die. Somebody dies every single time we play this game. No, not Jim. Anyone but Jim. Can you plead for pets? No? Ah, please. Why? 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 I know Jim was an elder, but why do I actually want to cry about this? Not my cat! You know, I was sitting here thinking, oh, I can use the crying photo as clickbait for the thumbnail. Nope, not clickbait now! <sighs> I, don't want, I don't want this to be happening to me right now. Oh god, I went into first person mode by accident. I forgot we had those on the wall there. Yeesh, he really sucks at art. Look at that. This is horrible. That's like traumatizing. I can't put that in the thumbnail. My cat is dead on the floor. No, don't come in here. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, Graham, no, no. Oh, you didn't have to see that. Oh, why did he have to see that? And he was by himself in there too. Mm. Why does he look excited? Tell me you're not cheering right now. What? Excuse you? Oh, I could so clickbait with the piranha pond though. If I put like a gravestone next to the piranhas. I mean, obviously it's a pet gravestone, but you know, you just... Oh, you know what? Now that I think about it, maybe we could leave Jim here. Jim along with Turtle and with Spatula. The three of them, they would have loved this pond. They could have watched the fishies and stuff. Granted, they're all dead. <laughs> Well, okay, if the boys are gonna become teens tomorrow, that wouldn't be such a bad time to adopt another pet. So let me know in the comments, do we want a dog or a cat? Cause I guess we've kind of been doing every other, like we had a cat, then a dog, then a cat. So maybe it's, maybe it's dog time. I don't know. God, I hate this game. I miss Jim. I liked Jim. I liked all those pets. <laughs> they just, they don't last very long is the problem. <sighs> okay, I'm really sorry. I d <laughs> You know, <laughs> I don't know 
why I'm acting surprised though. We should have seen it coming. Perhaps our next one I'll get from like a puppy or a kitten so we can have them for longer. That'd be nice. Okay. Well, Grim, can you get out of my house? I don't need this constant reminder of everyone I know and love that's been lost. I swear, me and Grim, we hang out like every day. Maybe I should like ask to join the Soul Reaper Society. What does that do? Actually, I'm not taking you to the flea market. My cat just died. Am I gonna lose my job? Wait, save the game before I do anything stupid. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> I don't know what this is. I've got to, I have to find out first, but ha, sorry kid. No open positions right now, but I like your moxie. Oh, okay. I thought it was like, I thought, okay. I got my hopes up. I just, I asked and he said no. And that's cool, but I love you, Grim, Bessie. Maybe we can compliment his outfit. Flatter him. Evangelize vegetarian benefits. Can we bring you to the, to the vegan side? Hey, listen. Grim, I've been doing it for years. It's really great. You like tofu, Grim? Thoughts? <laughs> okay, <laughs> I gotta go. I will spread my propaganda to the Grim Reaper another time. We'll have plenty more opportunities. Thank you for watching. If this is your first episode, feel free to go back and watch the rest. It's all really fun. I'm a little biased, but it's, it, this series is really fun. Until your cat dies, then it's less fun, but you know. Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, love you. <laughs> Why? The, the pets hurt so much more than any of the other sims. And I know that like, I guess that's normal, but I'm telling you, I honestly feel like I'm gonna cry about Jim. I feel like I just got Jim and now he's gone. It hurts.